Hey everybody, good afternoon. Today is Monday, January 3rd, 2022. Happy New Year. Um, this is Ben Capozzi with Broad Shoulders Farm in beautiful Halifax County, Virginia, Zone 7. I'm riding with Ellis here. Um, and I just wanted to do a quick um, checkup. We're actually on the farm road, so we're not doing this um, at anyone's peril, I don't think. Um, I'm just now getting to the farm today, and it's a little after one. Um, you may be able to see in the background, and I'll show some more photos. Um, it snowed this morning, um, but it's already up above 40 now. It snowed maybe three to five inches in town. Looks like less out here. Um, but uh, it's already, you know, the temperature's approaching 40. Uh, most of this is gonna melt away, but um, I didn't get here today until so late because I had to wait for my father-in-law to clear um, the access roads to the farm. There were, or the access road, um, there were a couple downed trees, um, but uh, thankfully he has the equipment and the know-how to get that done. So he got all of that taken care of and now it's clear for me to head up to the farm. Uh, Ellis uh, is coming with. Ellis didn't stay at the farm last night. He stayed at our house. Um, Elise was concerned about how cold it was going to be, but last night it was not even freezing. Um, tonight though, uh, it's going to get quite cold. It's going to be about 18 uh, around 8 a.m. tomorrow morning. So um, there's a lot for me to do at the farm today. Um, but I think everything's gonna be just fine. Um, you may notice I'm in a different car. Uh, I am riding in my wife's uh, old PT Cruiser that she got when she was in high school. This is our uh, backup car. I had some trouble with the Honda Element yesterday, which was very frustrating, but c'est la vie. Um, so anyhow, I'm up here and um, I'll flip the camera around and we'll do a little update and um, talk a little bit about what's going on. It looks like, well, here we go. Let me flip this around. It looks, it looks like the fence, uh, the gate for the waterfowl has been opened. Not sure how that happened. So I will go up there and check on all of them and see what's what. Um, and of course the chickens look entertained. I see them hiding in the high tunnel up there. All right, we'll do an update here in just a sec. So I have uh, almost finished my survey. And uh, I've got some damage from last night. Apparently it was a lot windier than I thought. So I'm gonna have to repair um, the roof on uh, one of the chick shaws that keeps blowing off. Hey, little duck. And I um, uh, need to repair the roof on uh, one of the, the ICU dog cage. Um, but anyhow, I thought I would just take a moment to show you guys some of the ducks enjoying the cold weather. I think it's about 35 or so. The snow is melting, but you know, a lot of folks <laughs> worry, about <laughs> worry about ducks being cold, but ducks don't worry about it. Um, this is the guineas for snow. And here come the geese. Hi, Reezy's. <laughs> the guineas are just getting pushed by the ducks. Or, sorry, the geese. But um, so far, everybody looks to be okay. <laughs> Hi, Greenies! There the geese come, big bullies. Kick the ducks out of their swimming hole. Off a little bit, but uh, so far so good. So the roof repair is uh, unexpected, but uh, I will deal with that. And uh, I'm still going to get some some planting done today. I've got a couple blueberries that I feel pretty confident I can get down, and I uh, want to transplant that one. So uh, anyhow, I'm going to go ahead and get on with my day, but I just wanted to check in. And I'm um, glad we got to catch the guinea and the geese parade. Hope you folks enjoyed that, I sure did. Um, more content to come this week. We got a lot of big projects, a lot of plants to plant. If you've uh, seen my Instagram feed, I've got like uh, close to 30 some plants I just picked up from uh, Edible Landscaping up in Afton. 
on uh, New Year's Eve, and I need to get them in the ground. Uh, even though we've got some cold temperatures coming, uh, our ground here pretty much stays workable year-round. So I'm going to work on that. But whatever you folks are up to, I hope that you are happy and healthy and well. Um, same goes for those that you love and care for. Uh, you can follow the farm at Broad Shoulders Farm on Facebook and Instagram if you're into that sort of thing. We'll talk to you all later. Hope your New Year's off to a great start. Bye-bye.